Double patty. This is smoke, smoke. Okay. Just the mushroom burger. Okay. okay, heading out to Wood Fire to get burgers with Jamie. And she's on time. No, she's early. I've known like a thousand years, and this is the first time she has been early. She's now on time, right? This is the first time she's early. I think she's kind of excited to get the burgers. Let's go. Ah, uh, yes. Saw it already. Yeah, I think we parked here. Okay. Let's go and get some burgers. We gotta go on the voiceover mode because the music is super loud. And that will create a copyright issue. This guy's open at 12 p.m. and we were here at 12.02 and there was already a crowd. So we need to wait for our turn. And some of the tables are already occupied. So the plan is to get the double patty and the smoke burger as well as the mushroom burger. And during my recent trip to Kuala Lumpur, I was supposed to get the wood fire burger but I didn't get a chance, so here I am. And it's awesome that these guys have decided to open up a branch in uh, Penang. We do have Marshall flips paid, but these guys are halal. So we can cater for a bigger group. Already placed our order, I think it took around half an hour. The wait time was half an hour before the handsome looking burgers found its way to us. All together, we spent an hour to meet these burgers. This drink? Hmm? What's this drink? What floor? Oh, root beer float is it? I thought you said some kind of passion fruit or something like that. Hmm? I thought you said passion fruit or something like that. <laughs> so they give the wrong thing, is it? Huh? They give the wrong thing, is it? Yeah. This is the double patty. We went for the beef. The chicken is not available, so all three of our burgers were beef. So yeah, that's some hot sauce there. Pickle, lettuce, I think there's tomato there, and two pieces of meat with some kind of a special sauce or hot sauce and here is the smoke burger so you have fried onion relish sweet relish pickle relish lettuce single patty but the beef bacon wasn't available so the person who took our order told me that they replaced it with turkey ham but where is the turkey ham and then the mushroom burger hash brown Slices of mushrooms, lettuce, and a piece of meat with orangey looking sauce. Seems generous, the sauce. Three handsome looking burgers. Curly fries with some kind of sauce on the side. The introduction over, it's now time to eat. How's the curly fries? Spicy, spicy barbecue. The burger is
Seven over ten. Seven over ten. Mm. So that is like above average, right? Uh. Above average and below my expectations. <coughs> yeah, it's nice, but it didn't wow me. Yeah, well. yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, well. This is the double patty. Yeah. Was it spicy or double patty? Spicy. Okay. Okay, destroy the cat here. Heading out with a full tummy. Decent burgers, enjoyable. Alright then, thanks for watching. See you in the next. 6.8? 6.8. Going to the founders. Let's cross. Why are you? Any doubt, refer through the gate. Sad covering to the call. Very interesting. All the lesser information is there. Okay, from now onwards, we're gonna go on the white solo mode because the music is super loud. There we go, the founders. There are a lot of signboards. Do you have to register for your seat? That's what it says there. But we didn't. We ran in, and there's someone at the door greeted us and seated us. So what, uh, there's carrot cake, what else? There is different uh, flavoured, um, what do you call this? Cinnamon rolls, there's bagel. Like we came miss mostly for the bagel because Jamie wants a uh, bagel. I think that's sesame, mixed sesame bagel. There's the dining area. 
this is the menu so the initial plan was to dine in but then it was really crowded super noisy so we decided to to take our food to go we came here around two something i think almost three maybe but i think people are still dining in having their lunch definitely a popular spot and the menu looks uh, yummy but we already had our burgers so there's no space there was also a very good selection of drinks as well hot and cold the ambience is very hip and then very maximalist leaving the founder gonna get some chakoi okay so yeah you see the mamu making it so if you want to watch a full video of him making this donut chakoi I'll put up a link. You can check it out. Because I filmed the whole uh, process of him uh, making the thing from scratch. There you go, the patong ko. Patong ko. Yeah. Yeah. Patong ko. Exactly, chakoi, but this is a halal version chakoi. I think regular chakoi is a halal what? Has in poke free. Right, so it is the Indian Muslim chakoi. Can you say that? Is just non Chinese ch chakwe. Yeah. Very soft. Best eaten with hot black coffee? Yeah, definitely. Okay. White coffee from the founders. Is it founders or the founders? Okay. Yeah, whatever. Let me say whatever. You can, keep, you can get the uh, strong taste of the coffee taste. That's that's triple shot. Huh? Triple or double shot? Triple. I, the normal one is one shot. Okay. I add another two shots. Yeah, so there you go. Now you can taste coffee, right? Yeah, yeah I can taste the coffee. It's strong. Imagine imagine if it's one shot. So you asked them to add it on uh, just now when you took no, the no. Uh, you order in your orders. Oh. Uh, yeah. Strong coffee taste, but it's triple uh, shots. Then you can taste coffee, right? You can taste coffee. This is the coffee is very big, my feeling good. Going to the pet shop get something something for Dodo and Jamie's gonna get something for the 20 old cats that she has. Let's go eat. inside the bottom box same oh okay different brand I'm gonna try a kopi curry wanda my first time trying this kopi curry jimmy has something here extra presso how is the extra presso jimmy oh it's milk coffee no it's milk coffee but more oh. coffee oh. Mine is just a tarik. Milk coffee as well. Oh, it's milk coffee as well. Alright, nice. But the coffee flavor is not strong, mm. but it's there. It's not strong. So the other one is stronger, is it? Yes. I like strong coffee. Milky? And then you get the coffee flavor. I think it would be nicer with stronger. I think that's why they have the other one. If you want something strong, you go for the extra presso. There you go. Kopi Tari by Wanda. Wonderful coffee. So I'm going to get this Mi Ali for dinner. So I'm going to get the um, Mi Goreng, Kweta Goreng, as well as the Bihun Goreng. Yeah, three. Like film the whole cooking process if you're interested. I I'll try to put up a link right, right up a link and if you're interested you can uh, watch it through the link. Click on the link if you're interested to watch the whole cooking process. This is our takeaway. Not bad their packaging. What's this? That's one one is yours, one is mine. Is it? That's the bagel. Okay, one one is mine. Look one piece. Is this the one piece? Ah, there's one piece here. 
Yours is uh, you, you have one bagel, right? Yes. Yeah, that's yours. Oh yeah, I will take out yours because I'm gonna take the bag. Oh yeah. yeah. This is Jamie's. I don't know, this is a four bagel flavor. Is it pistachio? I'm not sure what this is. What is it? Is it pistachio, the green one? Matcha. Matcha, okay. That's it? What's that? No idea. This is maybe cream? I don't know. This is chocolate. That's a uh, pecan salted salt caramel. This is biscoff. Biscoff. This is something rather. Okay. <laughs> That's the matcha, that's the chocolate. Yeah. Something rather. This is, I think, buy four and you get one free. 46 bucks, 36. This is a few of the things that um, I got from the founders or founder. Are they called the founders or the founder? Not sure. Yeah, the pastry place. And they have other stuff as well. Okay, so let's start off with the cinnamon roll. This is the classic. And there's some, I'm not, I'm not sure what's, um, there's something sprinkled on top here. Yeah, cinnamon roll. And, I don't know. I don't know what this is. Some kind of seed, maybe. Let's take a bite. Cinnamon roll. All right, let's take a bite. Mm -hmm. hmm. I got this for my sister. Oh yeah, we try it first. Sweet cinnamony. I oh, prefer without the sprinkle on top here. But when it's classic, I just like it like basic. Is it oats? I don't know what this is. Oh, I don't know. I think it's oats. And then you have your walnut here. Next, the bagel. I got the cheese jalapenos. Jalapeno and cheese. There you go. This looks beautiful. Yeah. Cheese bagel. Isn't it awesome? I cut in the middle and then spread some cream cheese. And maybe toast it. Let's take a bite. Let's put this color right here. Yeah. Cheese bagel from the founders or the founder. Here, just for us, take a bite. I'll give the jalapeno. Mm -hmm. It's a perfect bite. I'm getting the spiciness, the jalapeno, you know, the spiciness, the saltiness, and then I want to say it's cheesy. Good. Take a bite. It's chewy, not getting so much of the cheese, but this green bean here, giving out the spiciness as well as the saltiness. No, I think it seems like giant amount of cheese around here. Not really getting the cheese. That's why it'd be perfect if like cut open and then spread the cream cheese in the middle. That'd be awesome. I do like this. Yeah. Cheese jalapeno bagel. Oh, it's called the founder. The founder, yeah. I got a paper back here. I'm not sure you can see it. The founders. Oh, there. What did they find? This is delicious. Let's put this away. The last one is the scone that I'm looking forward to try the scone. Let's put this aside. Not sure. I think you gotta pay extra for the cream and the and the jam or the butter and the jam. I'm not sure, but so I didn't get the butter or the jam. I just got the plain scone. I'm gonna. I have. Uh, I have. Uh, I don't have strawberry. I have raspberry. So I'm gonna use the raspberry as well. I have uh, all these spread. The scone. I heat up in the microwave. So let's cut this into half. Okay. All right. And then one side. Let's do this side. Butter. 
This is the audio sprint. There you go. I enjoy eating scone. So yeah. There we go. Ugh. That's cool. Let's take a bite. Mm. Mm, cranberry again. Mm. Cranberry. Buttery, buttery, sweet, soft. Mm -hmm. oh. Bye bye. Thanks for watching. Show me again. The high end coffee, the chocolate, and the high end coffee. A match made in heaven. There you go. Oh yeah. That's it. I do like eating my chakoi with porridge as well, congee. One more round of two.